Bricklane and you can see the awesome wall art. This is one of the best areas in London and we have come to Shoreditch and it is famous for street arts and here the work changes almost daily. This vibrant part of East Linden is an ever-changing canvas for street art filled with spectacular graffiti art, magnificent murals, painted shutters, cool stickers and so many more. And there are so many more kinds of urban art in London. Graffiti is writing or drawings made on wall or other surface usually in the form of artistic expression. Graffiti ranges from simple written words to elaborate wall paintings. So, how are you enjoying friends? Isn't it great? Such an artistic way to decorate your city and to utilize the walls. Can you see this tunnel so beautifully painted? Spray paint and marker pens are commonly used graffiti materials and there are so many different types and styles of graffiti and it is a rapidly developing art form. Street art or graffiti is an important part of London's character. Can you see so many locks? These are also painted and by locking this, putting these locks, people ensure that their love is locked. Want to go for a street art hunting in London? Start with Shoreditch, incredibly rich in creativity. This is the graffiti hunting map for Shoreditch. London has free walking tour to these excellent graffiti works in Shoreditch. London's East End has become a mecca for artists all over the world. And if you have a fascination with street art and want to learn more about it, please you need to take a London street art too. In my earlier video, I have discussed about the free things that we can do and enjoy in London. And this is one of it. Exploring graffiti. Without exploring graffiti and knowing about this wonderful art, you are completely unaware of a part of London. So, be sure that when you are in London, take a walking tour to graffiti and uh, of course this is absolutely free and if you don't want to take a walking tour you can explore all by yourself all you need to do is take a bus or an underground and reach the short ditch stop and from there you can go on for a wonderful tour of graffiti from Old Street Station. You can walk down Great Eastern Street towards Brick Lane, Tucking Down, Rivington Street, Curtain Road and Red Church Street en route. The history of street art in Shoreditch During the early 90s, Shoreditch wasn't known for being a place that tourists would flock to see. However, over the last 20 years, the neighborhood has become a cultural hotspot that has birthed some of the London's best alternative artists. It seems like everything you turn in London, there's a street art piece just begging to be admired. From the walls of the department stores, underneath bridges and even on shop shutters, there are pieces of art. London's street art scene is as vast as its many types of street art scattered all throughout the city. The 
means gravity keeps on changing. So make sure you make a tour of it quickly as it could disappear within a matter of days or even hours. So how are you all enjoying friends? Liking them? If you love them, please don't forget to give a like on this video and make sure to take a tour in this beautiful part of East London to have a look at this awesome piece of art. And these are absolutely free. You don't have to spend a single penny for this. not just limited to the east area. As a matter of fact, there's a ton of pieces of artwork scattered all around the city in neighborhoods like the Tower Hamlets, Hackney, Canton and Brixton. If you really want to discover the streets of London for its many pieces of street art, you should really look up down and all around every nook and cranny to see what you can find because you never know what will be hidden in the most strangest of places. Oh, she's enjoying a lot. So enjoying a graffiti and getting to see a dance performance on the road like this is an extra like a cherry over the top of your cream. So enjoy have a nice day come to london enjoy the graffiti 